Hello again everyone, you'll be fed up of me today. Right, I've been asked if I will show how I make these borders. Um, they're not my idea. I first le learnt it from Eileen McInnes and if I can find her video I will leave the link. If not, I'll leave the link to her channel. Um, she did them, I don't know, two, three, four years ago probably and I really loved it and I thought, oh, I've got to have a go at that. Um, some of them I do, I've done on painty papers. These ones are just on junk mail or you could use magazines. You could use anything really, but... Um, so I, w I would like to say for these ones... That, say for that one that is just on a piece of painted paper that I've sort of had on my desk to wipe my brayer off on got loads of these sorts of bits of paper so I will just choose one of those which one shall we have I'll go with that one it's got nothing on the back um a minute so what i normally do i mean eileen's eileen's tutorials they're they're just brilliant how she does them i think she even starts off doing the painty paper uh all right so i would just this is how i do it I don't think about it, as you can tell. I mean, if you want to make them all nice and neat and straight, you know, you do it how you like, or make them thinner or thicker or whatever, whatever shapes you want to do. And obviously I'm do, doing it a little bit quicker than I normally would. So that's how I usually start off doing it. I mean, you could do all the stamping first and then do that bit after. But I just usually sit down at night time and do it. And I've got my stays on. In, it's running out and it's bound to run out, isn't it? Just because I don't want it to. And I've got all sorts of stamps going on. Uh, so a bit of a script stamp. Got this one from a these from a, a charity shop the other week. That's not going to want to stick to there. Oh well, never mind. And then I, I just <laughs> just go mad. I don't think about anything. You want it orderly and nice and neat then you know you do it how you want to do it but it's ever so easy and it? it's just relaxing i think use what color inks you've got uh how shall we have a little flower oh that one stick oh yeah that one's gonna stick I really don't don't think about anything it's funny how we're all different isn't it you know some people would have to have it orderly and probably that's probably why I'm untidy in the house and stuff I don't know wouldn't do for us all to be the same, that's all. Where did that one come from? I don't know. I don't know whether it came from there or not. What else have we got? Uh, should we have some arrows? There's a little arrow there, look. Where's it gone? 
little monkey. Oh, now where's it gone? <laughs> oh, there it is. It's alive. They don't want to stick. I've not used these ones for a while, I don't think. time with that one. I don't know where that's gone now. Is it gone? There it is. <laughs> but yeah, these are real fun to do. I think so anyway. A little... I can't even see what that says. I don't care whether I'm overlapping stuff. I'm not even looking whether you can see or not. And then you could, um, that's still on. All right, I'm going to call that it, but obviously you can take as much time as you want with as many different stamps as you want. Um, now you could start to doodle on them like that. For some reason, I, I like to cut them up first and I haven't got any to show you already cut up other than the ones I've done but um, oh, I'm, I'm going to cut one up <laughs> shall I and we'll just cut let's have a look because they're a bit fiddly to cut up so right well we'll just do these two Then I go back round the edges again afterwards. Just fast forward through this bit while I'm cutting these up. Go and put the kettle on. <laughs> Make yourself a drink. <laughs> I don't do speeded up videos. I did do once and people said that they'd prefer to... You must be some weird people that said that you prefer to hear me twaddle <laughs> oh dear dear no. I don't like sped up videos myself actually I would much rather just hear the person talking or you know just watch them at the end of the day if you know if you don't want to watch it all you can speed through it yourself can't you but I mean the thing with me is because of my deafness most of the videos that I watch, I watch with um, earbuds in. And the trouble that... I'm not complaining about anybody's videos because we all do it as we want to do it. But um, for me as a, a viewer and a listener, when, I, when I've got my earbuds in, if somebody's doing a talking video and then they put music on, the music, like, Oh, it kills me. And then they talk and then I can't hear. And, you know, so I, I do struggle a lot with watching people's videos sometimes. Anyway, that's that far. And then I just doodle on them. Any old towel would go back along this bottom bit. Whoops. Like that. Normally I say I'm downstairs and I've got them like right under my nose. But if I did that you wouldn't be able to see, would you? Shall we do? Can you see? Oh, yes. And just doodle on them however you like. I 
I do really like doing these. You don't have to be precise unless you want to be. You know, and it's a, it is a great thing to do with in, you know, magazines or especially junk mail. I mean, we get loads of these blowing leaflets through. I did chuck some in the bin today, but get loads of them th through the door and I thought, well, that's quite pretty. So... Yes, I mean, you could leave that like that if you wanted to. I'm not going to do loads and loads because I'm just not. <laughs> And then I would go back later on and probably do some gold in there or some white in there and um, you know, go back round the edges again. I really can't see what I'm doing a lot, to be honest. <laughs> oh dear. But it's all good fun. It's all good fun and I don't care. But yeah, if you go to Eileen's channel, she's got some really good videos, not just on these, but is it like watching paint dry, is it? Well, you did ask. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it was my white pen. Last time I was using my white pen, oh my goodness, it was leaking all over the place. Well, good fun. If you take a bit more time, they'll come out better, won't they? Why that one's squeaking? I think I need a new that one. Definitely need a new black one. Now, and what I usually do is go go all over with whichever colour I'm doing, i.e. the black one to start with, let them all dry. And then go over it with the next colour, especially if you're using a white pen. I like to leave it probably overnight. Because <laughs> I've not found a white pen that doesn't bleed through. Uh, just a minute. Millie's on the floor. See what this one wants to do.
Yeah, so that's how I do it. And I say that you'll find your own way of doing them, but they, they are really easy. But I'd say I do just like to, for some reason, I like to cut them out and do them individually, but I'm sure it would be a lot easier to do it all on the sheet at the same time. But there we go, that's just me. <laughs> Absolutely no idea what this looks like. <laughs> yeah. We can only do what we can do, can't we? And people shouldn't be put off of doing things just because they're not perfect, because none of us are perfect. Not even those that think they are. <laughs> you're not. You're not perfect. <laughs> right, I'm going to leave it at that. And I hope it's helped you a little bit. I would say if you, if you haven't got paints, you don't have to use paints. Just use a um, page out of a magazine. Pretty page out of a magazine. I was saying, I'm sure we all, everybody gets junk mail pretty junk mail not so pretty no, that's not such a pretty piece of junk mail but you can still um well yes i have put paint on these but haven't put so much on that one but i'd imagine everybody's got a bit of paint that's um crafty wise in this way but even if you haven't i'm sure you can you know there's going to be magazines that have got pretty pages in if you've got some felt tip pens and such like right as i'm talking even more twaddle than usual now so <laughs> i shall love you and leave you and if there's anything else i can help you with just give me a shout okay take care thanks for watching bye